stability, security. That's what people are coming to your firm to try to build for their own lives. That's and right. If you look at the last four years, Rick, it has been incredibly tumultuous. Uh, we've weathered the Great Recession, mm -hmm. but unemployment remains high. Job growth is stagnant. And one of the big things is federal tax policy. There's so mm -hmm. much uncertainty that people don't know what the ramifications are going to be on their own personal finances. So I wanted to sort of start with a basic question, which is for you, what is your economic <laughs> philosophy and how does that guide the kind of investment strategies you use? Well, now I love that you said uncertainty because that seems to be a buzzword that never goes away. Uh, clients tell me all the time that it's never been more uncertain than what it is right now, but I beg to differ. It has always been uncertain. If we go back five years, we were just as uncertain then. Ten years ago, just as uncertain then. We seem less uncertain about it now because we know what happened. But I can also assure you that five years from now, we're going to say, be saying the same thing. It's uncertain. And we need to understand that it's always going to be uncertain. And the way you deal with uncertainty, uncertainty in tax policy, uncertainty in investments, is through diversification and having a long-term strategy that you continually go back and focus on. So we start with uh, clients' goals, getting them to focus on where they want to be, and success is a long-term uh, long road, not a short-term one. If we're trying to guess what's going to happen with the market in the next 6 to 12 months, that's guessing, that's market timing, and that's very risky. It's easier to put together a strategy that's going to take advantage of the ups and downs that are going to happen, that's going to take advantage of the changes in tax policy, because you have the flexibility to be able to make changes as you need to. And that's really what people should be focusing on, not trying to guess what's going to happen in the next six or 12 months and being in the right things and out of the wrong things because nobody can do that, but taking a long-term perspective, staying diversified so that you can take advantage of whatever happens with the economy or with tax policy.